It's hard for Cindy to forget the first time she says she was raped. I was brought here in at gunpoint and sodomized right here in this corner. I thought, I thought I was going to die that night. I really did. Cindy never reported the assault to police. She says she's been raped about two dozen times and she's only called the cops once. Because a lot of them think that we put ourselves in those positions. This secluded area is where Cindy says she was raped. In fact, Albuquerque police believe thousands of women don't tell them when they are sexually assaulted. The majority of these women are prostitutes, undocumented immigrants, drug addicts, and those with warrants out for their arrest. Police think those are the types of women being targeted by serial rapists who know they won't call the cops. It's disgusting that we have gotten to a point where we've been outsmarted by the criminal. In 2017, police investigated 473 rapes, the most in the city's history. APD estimates there were actually about 1,400 more rapes that were not reported that year because women were scared. APD's estimates are based on data they have gotten from advocates who work with women in the community. Women have been going to shelters reporting they have been sexually assaulted, and most of the time they don't want to call the cops. Advocate Christine Barber keeps a list of all the times women have come to her. They will come and give us the reports, and then we in turn put it onto a list that we hand back out to the women, and it's called the bad guy list. Um, I personally have taken more than 1,500 rape reports. But the police department has come up with a solution they believe will make people feel more comfortable reporting sexual assaults. They have provided officers sensitivity training, hired advocates to call victims within three days after they report being raped, and they are sending plainclothes detectives to talk to people who report being raped because sometimes people can feel uneasy and intimidated by an officer in uniform. They'll also interview them in their environment instead of asking them to come to the police department. Advocates can also call sex crimes detectives directly. Now, of the people who reported they were raped to police last year, only a third of those cases were sent to the district attorney's office. The other cases were not considered for prosecution because the victim decided they no longer wanted to testify.